Human centered design advocate. What is human centered design? Why does it need an advocate and where does it come into play in healthcare? <laughs> so my PhD is actually in human integrated systems, which is about how do you design systems that have people and technology working together to accomplish a goal. And human centered design is what a lot of the methods and tools that are used in that space to make sure that you have your end user front and center at every stage of trying to design your system so that you make sure that it's going to work efficiently and effectively for the intended user. So a lot of what you hear now with user experience has a lot of its foundation in human-centered design methods and a lot of what you see in agile methods is actually very much founded in some of the user-centered design methods. It's how do you get your user and those key stakeholders involved early and often through the design life cycle so that they can provide input, tell you where you got it right, where you got it wrong, really pro provide valuable insight into the context in which uh, the system is going to be used. And I think your question about why is it important in healthcare, I think electronic health records are the perfect example of why we need more user-centered design in healthcare because the early versions, uh, the early iterations of the current generation of electronic health records really did not use user-centered design methods when they designed their systems. And once you have poor usability baked in, it's really hard to recover from that. So that's why some of the usability is so bad there.